Okay, I haven't done one of these videos for a while, but I wanted to uh, release a third video in my installing and expansion pack series. I'm going to be covering Silymph in this tutorial. And Silymph operates a little differently. One of the things to watch out for is actually overwriting presets that are already there. So that's one thing you want to avoid, and that's one thing I'm going to demonstrate today. So within Silymph, if you're familiar with Silymph, you've got four banks and each bank has a set of sounds. Now, if you happen to download an expansion pack, purchase it from somewhere, um, get one from a friend who's made a custom bank, whichever the situation may be, there are a few options to load the preset, whether it's the, an individual preset or a preset bank. Best thing to do would be, when you go to load a bank, it will bring up the main, I guess, file location for Silent and the original factory banks. And you can see here, I've got a few banks here for demonstration purposes. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to just load one of these. If we just refresh ourselves, we've got 128 samples within here or presets. I'm gonna load a preset bank here. And this bank has now been replaced with the expansion. Now, the, the important reason as to why you want to keep all the sounds in the same place is because, like I say, it, it overwrites, it doesn't remove it. It's not a destructive removal, but it does get rid of a, of a bank. In this instance, it's got rid of a bank of, of default presets. So ensuring that everything is in the same place, you'll be able to return the default presets. We'll go load bank, back to the factory bank. And there we go, we've got all the factory sounds back. The same goes for just loading an individual preset. If you go to load preset, uh, okay, in this scenario, I need to go to the primary bank. I have this installed. Okay, single presets, just load an art preset. And it's replaced the one of the factory presets. So you kind of want to avoid that, particularly if you, if you like the factory presets and you want to keep them. So yeah. This is the, uh, in my opinion, the quickest way of installing expansion packs for Silent. Important takeaway point is make sure all the sounds and all the samples are in the same place so you can quickly and instantly uh, switch out banks if and when you, you know, decide you want to. Hope that helped. Uh, check back for future videos in the series. Peace.